Hey, I know you've been dominating, but looks like you might have an even bigger test coming with Gunther and Imperium. Probably makes sense to get ready for anything. And since there isn't a ton of time, you might as well get ready for everything all at once. How about an extreme rules match against Tommaso Ciampa? It's the perfect way to prepare for that tough battle ahead, you know? The Black Heart. The following is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring, representing DIY from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, weighing in at 201 pounds, Tommaso. A multiple time NXT champion and has also held the NXT tag titles. And more main roster accolades undoubtedly on the way. It's the Warriors who's followed a dusty trail from the fringes to the spotlight. There's nothing better than extreme rules where unbridled madness and mayhem reigns supreme. There's always a lot of anticipation for a match like this, and as always with extreme rules, we should expect the unexpected. That seems to be the theme around here. He's been placed in the corner now. In the corner, and an elbow for good measure. Outside the ring now, he has no need to rush. I think we'll need to find something else to put our trash in around the ring. Because I guarantee that can is going to get all bent out of shape. Oh! Oh, you can hear the echoes of that trash can to the skull. Bam! There goes the trash can for you. That viciousness of Champa possibly being challenged. Oh, by a forearm smash! Champa getting dismantled here. Champa has to weather a storm here. Nice neck breaker. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. Setting foot in the ring now. There it is. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Launching. Diving leg drop. Mamma mia! The fight is being brought right to him. Yeah, he's really being put to the test. Turning the tables. And he is finally able to mount some resistance with that. We might have just seen the U-turn Chamba needed in this match. Getting carried. Unsure what they're thinking. Right across the floor. He's struggling a bit here. Well, you don't sign up for an Extreme Rules match without knowing the consequences, Cole. Oh. Golly, an endless trampling there. Oh, man, that's like death by a thousand cuts. Oh, merciless knee to the face. Both wrists captured it. That was nasty. Is it enough? Two count. And frustration might be starting to set in. Tossed into the corner. In the corner, and an elbow for good measure. Champa is in some serious trouble. Champa's resiliency is being tested here. Blast off! All the way to the outside. They got all of that. Just taking flight and soaring through the sky. And now gets tossed into the ring. Kicks to the face. 
Capped off with a big one. Champa trying to shake the cobwebs, but it might be too late. Uh-oh. Uh-oh is right. Package pile driver. This spells trouble for Tommaso. Makes the cover. And this one is over. Here is your winner. The Listen, champ, I've been thinking. The ring can turn into a right old brawl. Bodies flying and bones cracking. But there's a glimmer of beauty in that chaos. Now, what if we could take all that pain and fury and put it to good use, eh? A charity submission match where the art of the tap-out meets the heart of raising a few quid for those in need. What you say?
Oh my god. It's the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, the Dark Horse. <gasps> Can I have your autograph? Hey, Geneva. What brings you to these parts? You finally ditching that indie promotion and hitting the big time? Never. TVD is my home. You know I love the blood, sweat, and tears of the indies. WWE is all gloss and glamour. Seriously? I guess you've missed the last couple years of my run here. Jeez, relax. Somebody's lost their sense of humor since they worked for me. Sorry, I'm just a bit on edge with everything that's been going on. You know, if you want to get some extra work in to prepare for Gunther, we've got a TBD show coming up. And we just so happen to have an opening on the card. It would be nice to get some work in to prepare for Imperium. All right. I guess I can RSVP yes to TBD. What's the ETA? That's the spirit. I'll send you the details. It'll be good working with you again, Geneva.
Now that's what I'm talking about! Top-notch TVD action! That was wrestling at its finest. As the person in the ring, I can assure you, it most definitely was not. No need to be salty. This was a great night. You knew that was going to happen with Imperium, didn't you? You set me up. No. And, frankly, I cannot believe after all we've been through you could accuse me of something like that. Set you up? Me working with Imperium? No. Now... Did I think it was a possibility that Imperium could find out you were wrestling for TBD and show up? Yeah. Is that maybe part of the reason I asked you? Sure, but that's not the same thing as setting you up. Look, you got a chance to get work in, and I got a chance to make some dough. So we both win! Did we? I'm starting to remember why I stopped working with you guys. Always looking to make an extra buck. Yeah. Isn't that the whole point? It's a business. And business is going to be good after all the buzz around this. Glad I could help. <laughs> Me too.
bold move, challenging the longest reigning intercontinental champion in WWE history. That's who fortune favors, Troy. The bold. I suppose we'll have to see about that. I'm hoping that means you have some good news for me. And Miz has agreed to my request for a match with Gunther? Oh, no. Absolutely not. Miz giving you anything without strings? Could you even imagine? <laughs> no, but I didn't imagine having to deal with you at the airport either. Lucky day for everyone. Gunther could certainly be in the cards, but why rush into it when Miz has so many hand-picked opponents for you? Like Bronson Reed, who you'll be taking on in a non-title match next. You ready to head to the arena? This might be the first time you've ever given me good news, Troy. I can't wait to get Bronson in the ring. My goals reach no higher than the happiness of SmackDown's WWE Universal Champion. Undisputed. You left out a word there, buddy. Here comes the 330-pounder, Bronson Reed. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Glass Forest, South Australia, weighing in at 330 pounds, Bronson Reed. The kaiju of WWE, Big Bronson Reed. He has been on an absolute tear as of late. We've seen him beat some big names, compete in some major matches. I think it's just a matter of time before Bronson really hits it big. Gentlemen, big Bronson Reed is ready to claw through the competition. And I don't think anyone can stop him. The undisputed WWE Universal Champion giving a huge opportunity to his opponent tonight. A huge opportunity would be putting the title on the line. That's ridiculous, Corey. The champ has never backed down from a challenge because he's blinded by his ego, Cole. Sooner or later, that's going to catch up to him. Enough already. Oh, look at this combination of strikes. Like he's got 11 arms and feet. Setting him up for the flat line. Man, face first. Oh, vicious running knee lift. Reed is getting picked apart right now. All of Reed's power is smartly being negated. Devastating elbow. He's looking a little off balance. He planned for this and could still rally. Quick exchange, reversing the reversal. Oh, red right in there. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Plucked out of the air. The pin drop! Compromised position here. Right across the larynx. He was waiting for him to make his move. Reversal, can they go on the attack? Power slam. And shoulders are down. He is definitely struggling to keep him down at this point. Brought down with a DDT. Getting out of the ring, smart decision here. Shake off the cobwebs away from your opponent. Rights and lefts, elbows, knees, all of them lethal. Nothing was being held back with each of those strikes. Off into the pin. Two count. The champion with a big win here tonight. Wait, it's Gunther. Oh, man. Here we go. You asked for this, champ. The Dark Horse called out the longest reigning intercontinental champion in history. And the ring general is giving his answer.
Gunther is getting right in the WWE Universal Champion's face. And our so-called undisputed champs not doing a damn thing about it. Where the hell is he, Troy? Our general manager? He doesn't report to me. Zero interest in small talk, Troy. I want Gunther now. Do you? I mean, he was standing right in front of you and you didn't do anything about it. What are you trying to say? I'm not trying to say anything, champ. But it's all over social media. I was just reading a post from Roman Reigns that made you look like a joke. All the more reason not to keep stalling. Except there is. Our Intercontinental Champion is very important to the future of SmackDown, and Miz is off making sure that his top superstar is happy. <sighs> what now, Troy? What flaming hoop do I have to jump through for Miz to give me what both of us already want? You will be facing the Ring General's top lieutenant, Ludwig Kaiser. If I didn't know any better, I'd say Miz is doing the thing where he tries to wear me down before my next big match. Miz would never. I'm out, Troy. I'll beat Kaiser. Then Miz had better give me Gunther so we can settle this once and for all. Make way for Ludwig Kaiser, a man dedicated to the cause of Imperium and its leader, Gunther, proving time and time again that the mat is sacred. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring, representing Imperium from Hamburg, Germany, weighing in at 220 pounds, Ludwig Kaiser! Kaiser possesses impressive technical abilities, which he displays every time he competes. Undeniably refined in the ring is Ludwig Kaiser. He's so precise. He's kind of unnerving, too. Very cold and calculating. Unnerving? Calculating? Try entertaining? This man gives us a master class every time he competes. Here comes a competitor who takes immense pride in his work. Uh, that's a nice way of saying he's arrogant. Oh, you wouldn't know what it's like to have work to be proud of. And there he is. I find it interesting that Gunther was so quick to confront the champ last week, but now he sends out his flunky to do the fighting for him. That's why he's the ring general and you're not, Saxton. It's called strategy. Gunther does already seem to have the tactical advantage as the undisputed WWE Universal Champion is fighting for a chance to face the Intercontinental Champion, which is the opposite of how it usually works. into the corner. Guys, I can't think of a worse place for... Look at this athleticism. Oh, man, a nasty kick. Man, just a multitude. 
attitude of strikes. Knee oh. right to the face. You can't get caught in a hailstorm like that if you want to win. No doubt Ludwig is having trouble here. Yeah, Kaiser really has to show some more resistance. Look at that counter from Ludwig. Ooh, right to the throat. Torturous focus on the leg, punishing the leg. Pain must be shooting through that leg now. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Cradle pile drive. Ooh. I am not exaggerating when I say careers have been ended by less. A big punch. Ouch. And I think, oh yeah, Kaiser is bleeding. Now watch this, Northern Light suplex. Launching. Diving leg drop, Mamma Mia! He's on his heels a bit now. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. Might want to think about picking up the pace a bit. Two. Yeah, no, he doesn't get the three. Obviously still has some fight left. Oh, man. No doubt Ludwig is having trouble here. Kaiser is being worked on heavily. And he's able to reverse. And misses on the springboard. Uh-oh. Oh, this is going to be bad. This, this could be really bad. Oh, no, he Lights out. That could end Kaiser right now. The champ has proven himself. Imperium attacking the WWE Universal Champion. Did he really think the ring general wouldn't have a plan? This was a trap all along. And the dark horse walked right into it. Score one for Gunther. Oh, you look like you've been in a car accident, champ. <laughs> Miz wanted me to extend his deepest sympathies. That's not exactly how he phrased it on social media. I can't believe the flowers haven't arrived already. I'll have to put in a call. I just got the hell beaten out of me, Troy, in another one of Miz's traps. You sure you want to be doing this right now? No, no I am not. Gunther and his lackeys jumped me. I want to show them why I'm the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, up close and personal. Then you'll be happy to know that Miz has given you exactly what you want. You'll get your wish when you face Imperium next week in a gauntlet match. The following is a gauntlet turmoil match. The rules of the match are as follows. Two superstars will start in the ring. When one superstar is eliminated, a new superstar enters. Eliminations can occur by pinfall, submission, disqualification, or countouts. The match will be won if the first entrant eliminates all other entrants in the match. The undisputed WWE Universal Champion is here to run Imperium's...
Veni, Vini, Vici. And representing Imperium from South Tyrol, Italy, weighing in at 220 pounds, Giovanni Vinci. A man who believes the mat is sacred, but why not look good doing it? His resume looks good too. Multiple NXT tag title reigns and complete dominance alongside Imperium. This is a man who simply does not know the meaning of the word disappointment. There won't be any traps tonight. The WWE Universal Champion gets his hands on Imperium one by one. You say that like it's good for the champ, Saxton. How much of him do you think is going to be left by the time he gets to Gunther? The champ has faced down the odds from night one, Corey. That's why they call him the Dark Horse. He went right into that turnbuckle wow. corner and a couple back elbows to follow. Top rope, here we go. Sky high from the top. Finds the mark with a leg drop. Up top, Samoan driver. Oh man, what a shining wizard. Look at this! Now that was athletic. It's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. And Giovanni's resolve might be wavering here. Vinci's not showing any capacity to fight back. Look at this, going counter for counter. Going head to head, putting each other to the test. Ooh. And Vinci gets that set right back to him. Looks like a hockey fight's just broken up. So much pride, so much resiliency on display. And that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. Back and forth, back and forth, looking for the advantage here. Suplex! No, 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 no! Wiggles free from behind. Chop block. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. Is it enough? The cover. There's two. He's out. Giovanni Vinci's taken out of the gauntlet. They are out of here. And after this, two more entrants to go. Next into the gauntlet is Ludwig Kaiser. Just look at the WWE Universal Champion. This guy's already hurting and he's only in the second fight of the gauntlet. Of course he's hurting. Vinci wasn't in that first match to win. He was looking to hurt the champ. And what do you think Ludwig Kaiser is gonna do in this match? Haven't you learned never to count the WWE Universal Champion out, Corey? Ooh. First one missed, second one didn't. Effective. Oh, big punch. Ouch. Broke the mop. Suplex. No doubt Ludwig is having trouble here. Yeah, Kaiser really has to show some more resistance. Paying it right back with a reversal. And not a hair out of place as Ludwig salutes the crowd. Staved off that attack. 
Paying it back with their own counter. He's got something in store. He saw it coming, taking advantage. Just defenseless as the momentum is against him. This is where his fortitude will be put to the test. That could produce a dislocation or at the very least, a pinched nerve. And he slides him back to the mat. Running knee lift. couldn't go the distance. The fun's not over yet. Here's our final entry. The next fully no, 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 This man. isn't who we expected. Where the heck is Gunther? Must be another tactical move by the ring general. I love it. Can the Dark Horse take down the surprise opponent? What's going on here? Has Ilya Dragunov joined Imperium? He's at least stepped in to replace Gunther tonight in what I assume is an attempt to throw the Dark Horse off his game. What better man to recruit than one you've been to war with? Another incredible chess move by the ring general to punish the champ in this final gauntlet match. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. He saw it coming. Oh, vicious running knee lift. Tying up both of their opponents. Oh, legs. God, that hurts. Close line. Well, that'll leave a mark. A vicious stomp, and this superstar just reminding everyone how vicious they can truly be. Hammerlock applied, and this superstar is just imposing their will on their opponent. Dropping the elbow, and Dragunov's resolve might be wavering here. And Dragunov stuck and looking for a solution. Turns the tide for the knee to the abdomen. Well behind. Snap German suplex. No! Oh, the high risk doesn't pay off. Face meat floor. I think I see a few teeth on the floor. Thrown back in under the ropes. I just got a message from WWE.com. They ran a poll, and the majority of the WWE Universe thinks that it's Gunther's time to rise. Maybe the WWE Universe didn't see me take out two-thirds of Imperium in their hired gun. Or maybe it's that the Age of Imperium has such a nice ring to it. Epic. What do they even call your run, huh?
all this time as WWE Universal Champion, has anyone ever actually said it's your era? They don't have to say it. They know. Well, good news! After that gauntlet match, Miz decided that this rivalry has had the proper buildup. So you'll be defending the undisputed WWE Universal Championship against Gunther at Night of Champions in a no disqualification match, just like you wanted. Stacking the deck against me. Must be Friday. is a great champion, and he hasn't come alone. of the longest reigning intercontinental champion in WWE history. Listen to the hush in the crowd, Cole. The WWE Universe knows tonight belongs to the ring general. championship run come to an end the champ has stood up against every challenge that has come his way yeah 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 you both sound like broken records protecting this guy history has proven that the dark horse can overcome not gunther not tonight oh oh he retaliates oh my goodness dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball Gunther gets caught with a counter. He's heading up top. Big soaring. Whoa, what a landing. Big time risk pays off. The daredevil in you comes out when you take risks like that. Set it up. Nice neck breaker. I don't know what they're looking for here. A steel chair? Something we all know can be a devastating weapon. Oh! The challenger eating up some damage. 
We are witnessing a malicious string of attacks right now. These are the kinds of attacks that can put a superstar on the shelf for a long time. Fought off with an elbow. Oh, vicious running knee lift. Gunther can't find a foothold in this match. Gunther needs to cause some separation. Bang! So accurate. Fisherman suplex, nice. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. And the manager is searching under the ring. He could only be looking for something nefarious down there. And met with a right hand. Oh, oh, it's it cinched in, this could be over. We're gonna free the arm and does just that. The challenger is not in a great place. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This match could still go either way. He's just getting thrown around out here. He's on his heels, that's for sure. Right to the face. My God. Running knee left. This match is starting to take its toll. A oh, knee right to the face. That knee is a lethal weapon. Oh, that hurt. Oh, no, this could be bad. This, this could be really bad. Oh, no, the punt. Lights out. A championship level move. Got the shoulder up. Just barely able to kick out. I thought the champ had it in the back. This is how much the championship means. You can see the sweat drip out of the takeoff. From the top, find the mark with Electra. That's gotta be it. Two. And the champ retains. Here is your winner. And Before we introduce our next guest, let's set the stage. Cody Rhodes is still the World Heavyweight Champion on Raw, providing some stability after a tumultuous period that saw several champions come and go. I don't understand why we do these recaps. Our audience watches the product. Nonetheless, I'll play ball. On SmackDown, after continuing to dominate, the Dark Horse has become the Work Horse, now holding the undisputed WWE Universal Championship for three plus years. Didn't Miz and Roman Reigns think the champion stint would only last three days? And now he's approaching Roman's record-setting run. <laughs> Unbelievable. Why don't we ask Miz about that misguided prediction right now? Please welcome our guests, the SmackDown and Raw general managers, The Miz and William Regal. First of all, I take offense to the accusation that I ever doubted my champion. I know how to pick a horse, and in this case, I was behind the dark horse since day one. That's rubbish. You never wanted him to be champion, and you've done everything in your power to try to put an end to his reign. Don't insult the audience, Mike. They watch the product. That's what I've been saying. You want to do this, Regal? At least I have a cohesive show. No one can keep track of what's going on on Raw. It's like a freaking middle school play. Guys, come on. How do you even know what's happening on your show? You're too busy of filming episodes of your terrible reality show that no one watches. You just think you're better than me because you've made a living on the myth that you're some kind of technical wrestling genius. Well, I'm here to tell you, no one who matters cares. I agree with some of what you said. I am better than you. That's why they made me the general manager of the A-Show. Okay, maybe we take a break, yeah? No, we're not finished here. You think Raw is the A-Show? Yes, I do. But we can officially answer that question in the ring at Survivor Series. War Games! Fine. SmackDown will see you 
and beat you at war games. You're pathetic. We'll see who's pathetic, mate. Okay, let's get to that break. <laughs> 